Alright. Here we go. Thanks, man. Alright. First of all, I'm going to give you a little bit of warning as I get into this. I may, uh, well, I'm probably not going to make you cry. It's not my style. But I may get a little heated and uh, throw off a couple little naughty four letter words. So, heads up on that, guys. If anybody has a problem with it, you might want to step out because I don't censor. Alright. So. Everybody has always told you, and you've always heard, senior year goes so fast. And it didn't. <laughs> <laughs> this, this year, at least for me, has seemed to drag on like the guy from the Clear Eyes commercial. <laughs> Especially this last week, it's been going about, I don't know, two miles an hour, and I'm trying to get to freaking Ohio here, so... Alright, so that's my view. Juniors, some of you are going to have this experience. Hold on, because eventually you will get through it, probably. <laughs> um, Alright, so my high school career has, I don't know, I basically hated it. I didn't like school. There's been the occasional class I've had fun in. This one's kind of one of them. I like to hear my own voice. <laughs> um, but high school has been no fun for me, so I won't really miss the school. I will miss some of you people. Hutch, probably I'm not going to miss him. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, but the biggest thing, I guess, is I'm going to get into my little advice part of the speech, is going to be, juniors, get out there and do a ton of stuff. You know, play sports, join stupid clubs. This is the first year I've ever done quiz bowl, and I tell you, I had more fun at that than I probably had, you know, fun with anything else in my entire career. I mean, it was just something dumb I joined on with, and I had a lot of fun with it. The other piece of advice I can really give everybody, and this uh, probably works for seniors as you're going into college too, is I discovered through taking pre-calculus and then intro to calc, the brief calc, or whatever he's calling it now. Don't take anything you don't want to do, because if you do, it's going to ruin everything for you. I took that class. I've absolutely despised it. I hated every minute I was in there. So, as you're doing your class scheduling for next year, I'm not telling you to slack off. Take the classes you need to take. But if you know you're not going to like something, don't do it. It's just not worth it in the end. Seniors? Had some, uh, well, had some good laughs at me. I've laughed at you a couple times. Some of you I've uh, known closer than others. Same thing goes for the juniors. Again, some of you, I'm gonna miss. Some of you, not so much. I can safely say that most of you in this classroom, though, pretty much gonna miss. I mean, as I'm looking around. Thankfully, there's nobody in this class that I hate. But, <laughs> well, again, except for maybe Hutch. But who doesn't hate Hutch? Just a little. <laughs> but, uh, all right. It's been a, it's been an interesting year. It's been slow. Um, basically, what's got me through it has been my activities, even though some of them have seemed to drag on, just like the school year. Uh, but your friends are pretty much your most important thing. They're going to get you through those rotten classes. They're going to get you through your rotten, your rotten activities. Um, Probably never would have made it through football season, especially after I hurt my shoulder, but, you know, there's just certain people that you're willing to go all out for, and bless the county. Where's he even at in this classroom here? Loon's game. Huh? See, there you go. But anyways, bless the county pretty much kept me going through football, because I probably would have left after I hurt my shoulder, but you know what? Bless the county came up to me after practice on one day, and he's like, hey man, you alright? And I'm like, mostly. And he, uh... I don't know, just talk to me and stay. So if you ever get that opportunity, make sure you do that for somebody because I mean everybody needs a little pick me up every now and then. You never know, you know what uh, what the outcome can be if you don't do it. You never know what the outcome's gonna be if you do give them that little bit. So basically moral of my speech here is gonna be get out and do stuff and do what you love. So thanks for listening. We'll go.